Hey guys, today I have an unboxing from the cubicle.us. I'm really excited for the things that are in here, so let's get into it. So the first thing we have here are stickers. It appears as though they did fulfill my request to change the red in the Fulbright set to a, just a regular red. That's what I wanted. Um, I got two sets for the two cubes that are in here. Here we have lube. Uh, this is uh, the lube that I like, weight four. It's just in between your standard and your heaviest and it works really well for me. Here's a cube. Here's one of the cubes. As you can see, it is the Maru CX-3. Here we have the lighter springs, and here we have the Fangxi Shuangren version 2. These are two cubes that I'm really excited for. Which to open first? I think I'll open this one. Here we go. Um, so my version 1 is kind of failing on me. Um, it's not working so great these days. So I wanted to try out the version 2, and I heard it's really good. There's just some minor differences. I think the mold is more precise for the pieces, and so the cube turns better as a result. So let's do first turns. Yeah, so just as I was expecting, the cube doesn't feel as dry out of the box, which is just because of the uh, frosted pieces. Yeah, it feels a lot smoother. Uh, it looks like we've got some flash right here. Um, I'll have to go through and clean up the flash on the pieces. Let's check corner cutting. Uh, it's not so great, but it's tight. Uh, looking at the pieces, they do look to be a bit smoother, and I know there is a difference in the core, which I'm not going to go into right now because you have to uh, take the center off. So that's the Fangxi version 2. Of course, I'm going to be restickering it and lubing it with the uh, materials that I have here. So let's move on to the Maru CX-3. This one I'm super excited for. There we go. This is the Maru CX-3, designed by Cubix, um, my favorite YouTuber, which is really cool. And I saw his original video on it, and it looked like a great cube, and I'm so glad that it got mass-produced. Uh, right now, the corners are feeling a bit sharp like the Diane cube corners when you first get a brand new Diane cube so I'm gonna have to clean that up uh, the stickers look all right I uh, don't like the green the green looks kind of weird colored so let's do first turn um, it feels really nice but it's a bit tight I can just feel that much and the corners are really kind of messing me up It doesn't feel, actually, yeah, it does need lube. It's, I think it's really, I think it's dry in there. Yeah, it's totally dry. This is a edge. It looks a lot like a fangxi. There's similar things to it that a fangxi has. So, yeah, it's looking like a Diane. A little different. Corners are quite interesting, too. They fit in nicely with the edge, and then the centers look like a way long. This cube seems promising to me. It does need some work, though, but it has the feel of a cube that, you know, I would like. But I'm going to be working with both of these cubes. I'm really excited for both of them. These are looking like two very good cubes. Uh, anyway, that's really all I can say for now on these. So thanks for watching, guys. See ya!